Okay guys, week two. We are starting the first games. <clears throat> so, a bit of an issue with my team. I have forgotten to tick Gigantamax Factor on my Yoshifu. So, what has happened is I'm not able to Dynamax Yoshifu at all throughout the tournament. Tough one, but that's fine. We've got other Dynamax options in our teams. Hopefully, hopefully that doesn't cause us too much grief throughout the whole, or well, throughout the rest of the tournament. I am allowed to use Urshifu in battle though, because it still has the same stats. Just not the Dynamax Vector. <clears throat> hmm. Seem to have disconnected. Let's try again. Okay, here we go, guys. <clears throat> so, on Nate's team, we have Ruler Boom, Dynamax, oh well, G Gigantamax, sorry, Incineroar, Tyranitar, Dusclops, Torkoal, and Venusaur, a Gigantamax. Okay, we're going to pick our team. We have Charizard, Nine Tails, Venusaur, Rotom, Rillaboom, and also the Urshifu. So I've had a look at Nate's team, and I think the Trick Room option is going to cause us a lot of grief. So we really have to take that out. So what I'm thinking is we're going to go with Venusaur to start off with, to get that sleep powder in, then we're going to go with Urshifu. Now what I want to do is I want to put Charizard in there so we won't get hit as hard with G-Max Vine, Vine Lash. And what we can do is Probably put up some fake out support. Rotom's no good here. He'll just get eaten alive with Venusaur and Rillaboom. Although he's good for Torkoal. And in the Incineroar, Nine Tails, mm, not really convinced. So we will have to go with the Rillaboom. I think that's a good starting. If he goes with the Dusclops at the start, then we're in a really good position. <coughs> Probably going to start up with a Dusclops and a Fake Out user, so maybe Incineroar. Or maybe a little boom. Yes, it is. Incineroar <coughs> and Rilla boom. Oh, sorry, um, Dust Clops. I'm gonna take an Intimidate. He's got two options. He'll have to fake out one of us. So we'll have to do Dust Clops. Then we're going to go for a Wicked Blow on 
just double check that. Dusclops, then we'll have to do a wicked blow on Dusclops as well. <clears throat> Maybe potentially switching out, but it'll have to fake out one of us. Faking out the Venusaur. Wicked blow comes in. Let's see. Oh, Dusclops, KO'd. Okay, and we're in a really good spot now. Doesn't have the sandstorm, he's in a bit of trouble here. What we're gonna do. He can't protect, but he can max. So, what I'm thinking is. Hmm. <clears throat> Maybe it's time to go for the max and close combat incineral. Get Venusaur Dynamaxed. Tyranitar Dynamaxing 2. <clears throat> Wishfu with a close combat on the Incineroar. Ooh, not enough to kill him. But it does take him down quite a bit. G Max Fine Lash. Oof. There is a lot of damage there. Oof. Got a critical hit as well. Weakness policy. Flare? Interesting. Okay. Maybe has Venus on the back? Okay, Ushifu is down as well. Oh. Take a bit of chip damage there. And Incineroar's down. Okay, this is looking good, guys. Charizard. This looks very. Oh, Torkoal. Okay. His Torkoal does have Protect. So maybe what we can do Maybe we can air slash and just grassy glide. Take this turn and turn out. Turn out 
turn Taz out. Yeah, slash. Oh! Voided. Oof. That's fine. Good solar power. We're still good. Potentially use protect. Should we? Should we just go for the air slash? He's using heat wave. Could get the crit. Potentially knock him off. So he doesn't have. Okay. Air slash. Yes! Game one in. First game. Come on, guys.